I've been in robots for set about seven years, um, but some of the stuff I've seen today, which is great, it sort of like again gets rid of some of these myths that people, you know, may or uh, assumptions that they may make. We know robots aren't as accurate as CNC machines, but with the work they're doing now with the Comet project, um, somebody can maybe get a refurbished robot, two, three, four years old, uh, use the uh, these guys' experience and knowledge, and then maybe turn that robot into something far more accurate, uh, and therefore opens up a whole marketplace. Now that the market is, is, is seems to be um, really open to the technology. We're a startup company and we've been looking at this as a potential way of in-housing some prototyping operations. Uh, then I think that would potentially help a lot of other companies um, you know, do more research and development in-house, uh, speed up their time to market uh, and generally reduce costs. People have been talking about using robots to cut metal for so many years, but um, now to actually see that we're getting down to, to, to accuracies of uh, 50 microns uh, and perhaps less um, really does indicate that there is a, a, a proper future for this technology. Uh, first of all, I'm Paolo Conca from uh, ABB Robotics in Italy. And so we distribute uh, ABB robots uh, here in Italy and we use them uh, in every type of application. And it's combining robotics with uh, new offline uh, programming techniques and uh, with uh, intelligent sensors. So I think uh, uh, this type of project, this one in particular, will uh, help people to use uh, robots in a more simple and direct way. This kind of project is very interesting in the, uh, in, in, in the way that uh, he is uh, uh, analyzing the problem and uh, in the way that is uh, integrating the um, uh, the manufacturing uh, the, the, applica the industrial application. I hope uh, the, 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 this new technology help us to reduce uh, obviously the cost of uh, the manufacturing, the assembly, and also. Uh, have some, some gain in quality assembly and solve some issue in the in the in, in this field. I think that uh, this kind of project uh, help um, the support uh, the industry in order to be competitive. I think that the robots are the future because um, many reasons, mainly because of the flexibility and nowadays uh, you know that uh, the product uh, change uh, very fast. So what uh, we need is to have a very flexible uh, production system that uh, can be adapted very fast uh, to, uh, to, to the new product.